we have been hearing about covid 19 test and rt pcr as a gold standard for covid 19 test this rt pcr is made up of reverse transcription polymerase chain analysis chain reaction so in this class we would simply focus on what is reverse transcriptase when i say from any particle i am con from any uh, substance let's say the covid 19 virus i am extracting the rna now when this rna is converted into dna this process is known as reverse transcriptase however the process of conversion of dna to rna is known as transcriptase so that is the very first thing to understand now as you can see in this case we would have uh, the rna now this rna which is 5 to 3 sequence running would have the primer the rt or the reverse transcriptase enzyme and dntps so these are the three things required to have this function complete and get the process of uh, uh, reverse transcriptase completed from where we can have a single stranded rna to a double stranded dna or a complementary dna that can be seen so this sequence when it runs we can see that there is double stranded dna which is obtained so what is the process let's dive into this process step by step so the first step here is what the rna gets incubated with the primer at 70 degree celsius now this is the point where you are trying to denature the rna now once the RNA secondary structure is denatured it is chilled on the ice with the primer so first of all what we do is RNA is incubated with the primer at 70 degree celsius in this process it gets denatured once it is denatured there is uh, this is left on the ice to cool or to get chilled and this primer would anneal to the RNA now this process of annealing is very very important what happens in a metal industry in a metal industry to remove impurities what is done you suddenly heat and then cool and the same process happens in a reverse transcriptase you suddenly heat it at 70 degrees and then you chill it and after this chilling the primer gets annealed to the RNA and this is where the start of the reaction takes place now at this point the rt or the reverse transcriptase enzyme is added buffer and the dn uh, dntps are added to it now all these three are required for converting a dna to uh, rna to a dna usually we say what is the enzyme choice enzyme choice is either superscript 3 or mmlv are the two common enzymes which are used and uh superscript 3 is preferably used up to 50 degree celsius because it gives more yield at this temperature now what is happen what happens next is once this is done this is extended for around 1 hour at 37 degree celsius so that the transcription now occurs now once this happens the rt reaction is again heated at 70 degree celsius and the enzyme uh, is reacted and in this process cdna is formed so this is how we have a formation of rna to a double stranded dna what is required as i mentioned is the reverse transcriptase enzyme these enzymes could be either superscript 3 commonly used mmlv another common enzyme then we also have the primer this primer anneals to the dna and then we also need to have the most important component which is uh, understanding that how this primer would get anneal to it so uh, you would have the dntps which are used so with this process the reverse transcriptase uh, takes place so in this class we have understood what is reverse transcriptase and the basic steps and as we commonly hear about rt pcr test these days commonly done for covid 19 what is reverse transcriptase and what is polymerase chain reaction becomes important so in the following lecture we would focus on what is polymerase chain reaction stay tuned have a wonderful day ahead